let's create a hierarchy so it's time to create uh, by using it's time to using these uh, dimensions or attributes to create a hierarchy so i know the granularity of the data and you have to know that this data is starting from started from the granularity of the data is started from country then state then region then city then hospital okay that's the hierarchy so likewise for a date attribute we have admission oh, we have not added year also i need to add year also create a new attribute and i will just pick year as well in patient add function then choose this date time function and year next Admission year in which year the patient is admitted. So this is suffice enough to create a hierarchy. I am going to create a hierarchy here. New hierarchy. First of all, I will uh, create this. Country add. You can promote and demote the fields over here by using this button. Then what? Then state. Then region. Region and city. And then hospital name or hospital location. Okay. Hospital location. These are all mine. So whenever you have huge number of uh, attributes, it will be difficult to find out one. So this field will be uh, helping you to select. See, I'm just clicking uh, here. So searching it. Hospital, so it is so it is searching all the patient names, etc. Hospital location, that's it. So, this let it be of my first uh, a hierarchy, okay. So, this hierarchy is added from this to this, this to this, and if you want to see. The new attribute, if you want to add a new attribute to the hierarchy, straight away you can add it at any point of time. Okay, so my connection broke off, my uh, Wi Fi connection broke off. So, what you did was added the um, hierarchy objects for hierarchy, and then you haven't saved the hierarchy yet, right? I'm sorry, so you added okay, the location, city region what about country and uh, state uh, i have added first country okay. then state oh it's... then region then city and then location it is just basically arranged from so why yeah. why is the order from right to left then you can make it auto arrange oh it's basically uh, auto arrange uh, and then order so it is the, you cannot say these are all orders you can basically keep them in uh, it's just a field oh, which, is, uh, which is visualizing here mm -hmm. it's up to you okay. 
So if you want to add a new attribute to the hierarchy, you can add it any point of time. Seven close or seven new, seven new. So we are creating. Uh, it has been defined as a drill hierarchy. This hierarchy will be used as a reference when drilling in report. So okay. So now it's become a drill hierarchy when you create a drill down a report. This hierarchy will help you to navigate. Okay. So the hierarchy name I'm going to define is. Demography, demography hierarchy. The next hierarchy I'm going to create by using my admission uh, time dimensions. Okay. So first I will take as admission year. Admission year, then admission quarter, then admission month, then admission week, admission week, and admission weekday. Weekday and and then admission date or admission uh, day day of the month so this has become the hierarchy of the time dimensions you can promote or demote at all attributes at any point of time save mm -hmm. and again this is also arranged from lower to higher Save and close. I can name it. Time dimension hierarchy. So two hierarchy we have added. The entry point is admission year. Here the entry point I can define is country. When it is entered to this uh, hierarchy, you have to go from the higher to lower. transformations we can have here so uh, hierarchy is okay with you mm -hmm. so transformations can be like uh,
basically this is uh, um, you know if you are going to add a new attribute in which other attribute should be joined and mm -hmm. this performance uh, this activity is done here so for example hospital uh, location so in transformation you combine you can combine attribute yeah combining attribute so you just add so for example yeah. you could you could um, combine first name and last name to make it into a name cat attribute no 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 that's not the transformation it's basically uh, when you're creating a dimension uh, you can um, uh, uh, we have here a second um, there's a function uh, while creating a new attribute you can straight away combine first name and last name just wanted to see mm -hmm. here in the attribute only i have a first name Mm -hmm. Patient name. Mm -hmm. Rename patient. F name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'll add new attribute which I will just add patient last name. Mm -hmm. And middle name as well. Patient. First name, patient, middle name. There it is. Patient last name is patient last name. Okay. So this is what we have here. I will mm -hmm. 